in uh, Reykjavik. And uh, good afternoon to participants in Beijing. Iceland has been harvesting renewable energy for a long time. In 1930, coal burning pollution and CO2 emissions darkened the horizon. After the city of Reykjavik began to use hot groundwater for central heating, the pollution disappeared. Today, 100% of Iceland's electricity and house heating is powered by sustainable and green hydro and geothermal energy sources. Icelandic companies are active around the world in sharing, sharing their experience on harnessing and utilizing, utilizing renewable energy. Core areas of expertise include geothermal power, hydropower, power transmission systems, and carbon capture and utilization and storage or mineralization. Iceland has set ambitious goals aiming for carbon neutrality by 2040, and to reach those targets, everyone must come to the table. We are especially proud of companies like Carbon Recycling International. Their technology can be a transformative tool in our fight to combat climate change around the world. I therefore welcome this collaboration to design a chemical plant in Jingzhou provinces based on sheer ice emissions to liquids technology. The Jingzhou sailboat green methanol plant will recycle 150,000 tons per year of CO2 to make materials for solar panels. That equals 53,000 fossil fuel cars and saves around 550,000 tons of CO2 emissions per year. This agreement between carbon recycling and Jingzhou sailboat petrochemical highlights the growing bilateral cooperation between Iceland and China in this important field. It is a significant step towards a transition to a more circular economy. I congratulate everyone involved and look forward to following the development of this collaboration. Thank you.